Okay, we're here with Steve Ballich, the township supervisor. I wanted to ask you a question about the uh, senior living raise, right? So there's been a lot of chatter on Facebook and stuff. Uh, people are upset. Oh, you're, you're raising the, the rates on the seniors, blah, 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 you know. But as you explained it, there, I guess there's a lot of uh, repairs and stuff to do that haven't been kept up with. You want to explain that? Yeah, well, we uh, just got done fixing all the asphalt and all of the uh, driveways. And then we did all the concrete sidewalks so all that stuff that's been there has been there for like 25 years or more so since it's been built so it's all starting to get worn out which is just life you know there's a life cycle on this stuff the roofs have a life cycle uh, the uh, heating and air conditioning units are a special type of unit I don't know what it's called it's just a one of a kind type of thing and uh, it costs us about $12,000 for each unit, and that was using prices from spring, like early summer. Early spring. Yeah. Uh, so it's going to be more than twelve thousand to uh, change it over to gas forest air, mm -hmm. and we're going to have to be doing them in the near future. We just don't know how many we're going to get at one time. And raising the rent only affects new people moving in, not old people that are there. Yeah, they were grandfathered in. From what I that are there. How long have they? They've haven't had a raise in rent for uh, some time, right? Or? Before us, it, it was like uh, I don't even know how long. A real long time. Yeah, like uh, fifteen years or something like that. Okay, but uh, it was a real long time, and uh, now they're getting five percent increases. Up, I should say, up to five percent. If we don't need the money, we're not going to raise it. Mm. But and, we don't. At this point, I've applied for uh, a lot of different uh, government funding. But, uh, That's what I was going to ask you. That grant you were talking about, um, uh, did they specify it has to be 62? Is that why you raised the age? Well, I asked, or, I asked uh, the person I was talking to, is it better to be 62 or 65? And they said 62 is... Uh, In order to get the grant, right? Well, not to get the grant, but it's an operable number. Okay. They said. So I've taken it that that's the better number of the two. Right. So I don't know the answer. And so rather than just guess, I go with a professional, what they're telling 62. Me. Yeah, so 62 is a good number. Okay. And uh, I, I think I was told we have a good chance of getting something, not probably all of it, but we have a good chance of getting something. To make, and those are going to make the improvements, right? Right. Go towards the improvements. Is, uh, we're going to have to start. You know, I'm, I'm hoping it don't happen this winter, but it could. I mean, how many, when something's 25 years old and it's a furnace, mm. you don't know when it's going to break off. So are you going to be moving in there or are you too old? No, I got my own house. <laughs> I don't want to move in. But those are really, really nice units. All right. Garage and everything. All right. Thank you very much.